So that's my little vice. I love Starbucks. I love going in there. It's fun when you go in there and you give your order and sometimes they ask for your name. I like to just look at them and go, I'm Batman. Because <laughs> there is nothing better than watching a barista stand there and be like, I have a latte for Batman. <laughs> And they have to say it. They have to. It's great. You can give him any name you want. Any name. One time I was there, the dude's looking at the cup. He's like, uh, one caramel frap for the Lord. <laughs> and I'm like, thank you, my son. It's good to be back. You give any name, any name. This morning I gave him my Hebrew name. Yeah. I was like, I'll have a decaf latte. Sure, can I get your name? Yeah, Elazar Yaakov Ben Shlomo. <laughs> she was like, um, do you have a nickname or something? <laughs> well, my friends call me Jew Bat. <laughs> I'm not riding that on the cup, sir. <laughs> All right, fine. Then you could use my American Indian name. Puts nothing in tip jar. A minute later, I hear, one decaf latte for a Jew <laughs> Yes, thank you guys. You guys are awesome. I kid the Jews. Where are my people here tonight? Where are my people? Yes. There we go. Love the Jews. Love, proud to be Jewish. You know, think about this. Judaism is the only religion that doesn't try to recruit new members. Probably because we know we can't get any. I mean, seriously, what's the selling point there exactly, right? What's the commercial for Judaism? Tired of that excess flap of skin on your p <laughs> Want to stop eating three of the most delicious foods on the planet? Bacon cheeseburgers and bacon double cheeseburgers? Or perhaps you're ready to give up eating altogether and would enjoy partaking in one of our numerous fast days. Well, then Judaism's just for you. Do you crave persecution? <laughs> Scapegoating, enslavement, and or genocide? Want to be hated for controlling the banks and the media, yet you're broke, you're not on a sitcom right now, you gotta schlep to New York, tape a special, hope when it airs you get more than 408 Twitter followers. Anyway, that's just me. The point is, the point is, The point is that nobody wants to join us because nobody wants to be like us. Nobody. We all want to be black. I want to be black. We all, we, we live in a society that emulates black people. We want to be black, dress black, talk black. We text black. I sent out a text this morning. I was like, yo, what up? Where are you at? I've never said that sentence out loud in my life. But that's how I text because we have this societal peer pressure to sound hip and cool when we text. And what people do we associate with being hip and cool? Certainly not my people. <laughs> Nobody texts Jewish. So how's everything by you? <laughs> OMG, you know. <laughs> my 70-year-old Jewish father sent me a text last week. Sup, son, sup. S-U-P-S-O-N, sup. This is a man, when you meet him, he's like, hello, how are you? It's a pleasure to meet you. And he's like, sup, son, sup. He talks like an old Jew, but texts like he's got a three teardrop tattoo. Thank you. <laughs> Here's all my parents do now. They, they sit around the house and they talk about movie stars from their generation who died recently. And it's always these obscure names to me. Like they'll be sitting there like, so did you hear? Myrna Loy died. Mm, 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 mm. The pathetic thing is I know pretty soon I'll be doing the same thing. I'll be sitting there like, you know who just passed away? Jean-Claude Van Damme. <laughs> and you know who else died the same day? Remember the rap group, Salt and Pepper? Salt. <laughs> Salt died. Mm, 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 mm. By the way, that right there, that's the difference between Jewish people and black people. It's just a matter of mm, mm to mm, mm. <laughs> yeah. See, every cool ethnic group has something funky going on with their necks, right? Like the Italians, Italians of, how you doing, huh? How you doing? Japanese man, arigato, arigato, hello, hello. Arigato. My favorite is the Latino women's circular neck thing, the home. Yo, 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 listen, oh man. Listen, oh man. 
all right? It's just white guys that have nothing going on at all. It's like, hey! How's it going there? Yeah, good to see you. Hang on a second. What's that? Yeah, I'm talking to him. I can't talk to two people at the same time. Let's set up a conference call. Um, 